Have you ever wanted to compare fabrics side by side before making the final selection to add to your shopping cart? Our designer's palette was created just for this purpose. We again have expanded both the capacity and the functionality of the simple wish list to enhance your shopping experience. Here's a quick overview of the unique features that are available. You can save unlimited fabrics to your wish list and now you can create multiple wish lists. It's easy to click the Add to Wishlist link while you browse through the thousands of fabrics offered. A pop-up window is presented, which gives the option of adding the fabric to the general wishlist, or you can create a unique wishlist for specific groups of fabrics. Themes, collections, project names, quilt block names, use any name you want to assign. Also, when viewing a detail page, which is accessed by clicking any thumbnail, you can add the entire collection to an existing or new wish list with one click of the link that is available. All wish lists will be saved throughout your shopping session and be available whenever you return and log in to the website. To view the items you have saved, make sure you are logged in and click the wish list link at the top right of the page. On most desktop and laptop computers, we recommend viewing the designer's palette in full screen mode. Click the full screen button. To return to your regular browser screen, use the exit full screen button or press the escape key usually found at the top left of your keyboard. Each of your wish lists will be shown in a drop down. No matter which you select, they are automatically categorized by color and you can view them together in a scrollable display or you can select a color category from the drop down menu and view and work with one color group. Begin by dragging one of the swatches to the work area. You can drag and drop as many fabrics that you would like to compare to the work area. Need an enlarged image? Select any swatch and drag the handles or use the plus and minus buttons to change the size. Clicking and moving a swatch that is already in the work area will bring it to the top of the fabric array. Whenever a swatch is selected, you can view the fabric info, including the manufacturer, collection name, the thousand of bolts item number, fabric type, quantity in stock, and the manufacturer's pattern and color numbers. The copy button will allow you to keep a fabric in the active wish list and also copy it to any of your other wish lists. The move button will remove it from the active wish list and place it in another wish list that you select. Add a fabric to your cart by using the button. Keep it in the wish list or remove it to prevent duplicating the order by checking the box. Close the pop-up by hitting cancel or the X at the top right of the window. You will not be sent to the shopping cart after each edition, but you will notice that the items count and the subtotal of your cart will reflect each purchase. Clicking the link will take you to your cart for checkout or review. Return to the wish list and designer's palette by using the wish list link at the top. Everything should look the same, including the fabrics in your work area. The recycle button will remove a selected swatch from the work area, but it will remain in your wish list and the fabric selection box. Use the delete fabric button to remove the selected swatch from the work area and the wish list. Don't worry if you click this button accidentally. We give you the opportunity to reconsider with a pop-up window. OK will delete the fabric. Cancel will leave it. Occasionally, you may notice fabrics in your wish list with a sold out tag. These are no longer available to purchase. If you still need to use something with a similar color value, click the Replace button. This will show an enlarged image of the selected fabric and allow you to use the color matcher to find suggested replacements. Please watch the color matcher video for detailed instructions on using this feature. Want to clear the sold out items or clear the entire wish list and start over? Use the buttons under the scrolling display. Both will give you an opportunity to change your mind with the pop-up warning window. Clearing all fabrics from a named wish list will also delete the wish list from the drop-down menu. If you have more time and want to see how your wish list fabrics look in actual quilt block designs and real quilt layouts, use the other features in our Dynamic Quilters Toolbox, a unique collection of tools to help you visualize your ideas. Click the logo and start designing. An instructional video is available from the drop-down under About Our Site.